Good morning, everybody. It is Julie with Obesity Is Not Me. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do so. And I am in day 106, day three of my blast. And yay! Uh, there it is. That is for Maria. And I am happy to report that I did not go up in weight today. Yay! With And I had pasta last night. I had pasta and meat sauce. Full on Italian pasta. Um, I, I like to get the Italian because they don't use the GMO wheat. So, and it was white pasta. Holy cow, I can't believe I did that. But anyway, <laughs> well the nice thing is I am prepping right now for my fast coming up. And what I do is I do, I prep for it. So I made massive amounts of pasta meat sauce with peppers and onions in, in the sauce. Um, Cause that's how my husband likes it, with cheese. And so I made a bunch of it. So now I have a dinner, a big portion, and a small portion for him for lunch, all ready to go. So that next week, well, it's not even next week, but it's coming up pretty soon. When I am in my fast, I have it frozen in the freezer, pop it in, there you go. I got two, two uh, meals covered with that. So, I'm doing this for my friend Maria. There she it goes, just so you can see what I'm eating. I had oatmeal yesterday. It was fantastic. I used to eat oatmeal all the time, and it really satiated me. I was really had a light lunch yesterday. It's really hard to eat three meals now. I find it very difficult, um, especially after that oatmeal. It's like a it's like a brick in my stomach, and it, it, it was really good. I I was ready for some oatmeal. Um, and yeah, like I said, then I had apple orange. I had corn on the cob yesterday. That was delicious. And my oranges and my, um, OJ and stuff. Um, yeah, so I got, I got good hits of my antioxidants again. I feel fantastic right now. I am now switching back into keto. So I'm going back. I need to kind of get those swings down before I go into my faster fast. So with that, I am back into uh, keto today and I'm back into my 16-8 window. Thank you, very happy. I'll probably go to maybe one or two. I don't know, I don't know what time I'll go to. I'm comfortable right now. I'm actually not as hungry as I thought I was gonna be. Um, having eaten all that fruit and pasta and stuff. I actually thought it was gonna be a lot worse. So, um, so I'm psyched right now. Um, I had a great workout yesterday. Well, not great, I mean, I was slow. I'm still congested and stuff, so I'm still working on that. Um, I went an hour on the treadmill, an hour. I went three miles and I walked her. I was listening to everybody's uh, videos. Um, sometimes when I'm on the treadmill, just to let you know, um, I hit to make comments and I don't think they go through sometimes, but I am watching. I am watching, you know, there was an hour of watching everybody's videos that I have, I'll use, that I've subscribed. I hit, even have y'all on my bell. Um, I actually wanted to show you this too. This is, this is my apple a day. So isn't that cute? My little green apple. Um, I don't think it's that meant going to be that many carbs. I think I'm, uh, I, I think I'm pretty safe on keto eating an apple a day when this is my apple. I don't even know what the carb content is. I'm going to take, I take about 10 or 11 for this little guy. So that's what I do. So if everybody says you can't eat carbs or an apple on keto, I'm doing it. Maybe the keto police would say, yeah, I can't, but whatever. But that's what I'm doing. Um, I got my my little cocktail. I'm working on gut health today. That is my big thing today, as antioxidants were a blast of antioxidants, and now I'm coupling. Now I'm gonna rebuild my gut health. I've got my apple cider vinegar. I have ginger in here, apple cider vinegar. I have cayenne pepper and lime in here. This is kind of my little cocktail with a little ice water, so it's super cold. I like it super cold, then I fish out the ice. And I'm gonna go ahead and take this right now. It's 
not bad. All right, mm. I like that ginger bite. Helps me to get ginger in. I, I like ginger, I could actually make like a, my own little ginger ale um, with my soda stream. And um, I don't mind it. It, it, it's pretty good. But I, but I won't do it all the time. So I wanna, I wanna make sure I get my ginger in. It really helps my stomach. Um, so that's what today is. Today is getting back into keto, doing some nice pulling back. I was at a 12 and 12, you know, going back to my, my very happy 16, eight uh, feeding window. Sometimes you have to go back to go forward. And if you know what I mean, um, this is a Thomas DeLauer thing. He, he is just like, don't sit in it for too long. Um, you know, you've got to switch it up. And Dr. Mindy Peltz, too, she is a big proponent of if, if it stops working, she roves it. Um, she'll like roll people on the different things every three days. So I, I might do that. I love change. I love changing it up. So that's what I'm thinking. Um, but right now I'm back on keto until my fast um, and I'm not fasting over the weekend because that's uh, my time with my husband and and he doesn't want to. He's going to do a 24 hour with me this, um, this prolonged fast so that's nice. So that'll be cool. Um, but I am preparing and I'm getting all his meals ready. So I'm getting like everything. So every time I cook this week, I'm cooking extra, freezing it. Cooking extra, freezing it. Like I'm gonna make chicken tenders for him. It's one of his favorites. Um, I'm gonna make them with, uh, with pork, pork rinds um, for me because I'm back on keto. I'm back on full fat. Um, I missed the full fat. I did. <laughs> I miss keto eating. I'm like, you can't have that. You're gonna blow yourself up if you if you keto eat and do all the fruit and all, and do pasta. Boom! <laughs> they warned me. They warned me, <clears throat> and I heeded that warning. So I'm only up about uh, probably just under three pounds. So yeah, looking to get it off. I'm ready to go. I'm I'm excited. I'm rejuvenated. Hopefully this cold will clear up. I have three more days on antibiotics and then I can jump into my fast. So anyway, all right, well, thanks for watching and it is raining in Southern, Southern Florida today. So it's kind of nice to break out my little windbreaker here. So anyway, have a great day. I will see you tomorrow.